The system is also built in a way to support this kind of stuff. Yeah. People are taking over the automobile company system. The color of the black. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, black is unique. Black is from is bold. Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, girl, the new girl. Today I am here with some friends and I would like to ask them their feelings on how, like I'm giving them the opportunity to feel my car and give me their honest review on this car, whether they would buy it, given a chance, or it's a pass for them. So yeah, today I have my first girlie here. So yeah, wait and hear what he got to say about the neo electric cars especially the ec6 that is my car so here we go my vlog today you have the opportunity to drive my ec6 and you're gonna tell me how you feel about it whether you like it okay we're gonna start with the interior of this ec6 how do you feel about it sleek you know the car the interior is very sleek you know well detailed mm -hmm. and what i like about is the navigation you know right here right the, the board i don't know how they call it i don't know the, the pad the pad you know yeah because you can put it address the location where you're going right here mm -hmm. and that just directs you yeah and you can just go you can just go mm -hmm. so i like it and the the steering the wheel? steering wheel the color of it the black mm -hmm. you no know? no black is unique yeah. black is strong it's bold yeah. right yeah so yeah and the seats, yes. the, leather, the leather seats, you know, yeah. right. well done. And also on the seats, did you feel that there is the movement, like oh. of the seats? Uh, yeah. And, yeah. And the, the level of the seating, whether you want to sit a bit higher, higher. or lower, how do you feel about that, the changing positions you can on the Neo? literally turn the whole thing into a bed. Like, <laughs> even when you're driving <laughs> on the highway it. and you're tired, you want to take a rest, you can just you turn the whole thing into a bed. You can just lift the seat up. Mm -hmm. You can turn it back, move it back, move it forward, mm -hmm. according to how you, you feel. I mean, how you want to drive, and so I just I just like it. Yeah, because of that, it, it also makes you feel very comfortable to customize and, and you it. Know what I like about this place, the dashboard. The dashboard. You see, oh. it gives every detail of every person in front of you and behind you. Right. So right now you can see all the cars moving here. It shows you the car and even the motorbike that are riding right in front of you. It shows okay. the detail. So, so that's there's a 3D so much. Camera. The 3D camera is so so well built here. Mm -hmm. The and navigation, the sensors. the sensors of this car is amazing. Right, right. When okay. you're when you're driving, you lose, lose focus for a minute. You get notified by the the system. Like look straight, you're not focusing, the, and that's so amazing about this car. Right, amazing. Now looking at the sound system, do you know that this car has so many speakers in it? I, I don't know, mm -hmm. but I tried playing music moments ago. And the sound quality is yeah. out of the world. Right. Right. Yeah. I can just have a party in this car. I love music, right? When I next time I'm driving, I play loud music. Right. So if I have this car, I feel like as soon as I start driving from my home, the whole city will know like Chris is coming. That would be my signature from the sound of this car. Good. Good. It gives nice sound. All right. And another thing, we probably have noticed by now that the inbuilt, like the AC, the climate control, the seat control and stuff. How do you feel about all this? Like it's winter right now. It's winter. Mm -hmm. You know, this is a, a car built according to the system of the world now. Mm -hmm. We are in winter right now. Right. Before you even come to the car, right in the comfort of your home, you can just turn the heating system. Right. You need to heat up the whole car system before you get into the car, you right. know? Right, right. So you can see from here, we can just change it, but just a click of a button right here changes everything. In the car? In the car. Right, right. And um, another thing is uh, the cameras. The cameras on this car, do you think it's worthy to have so many cameras <laughs> here? I think last time I tried to count, 
I couldn't find some of the cameras. I think there are hidden cameras even under the under the seat. Under the seat, <laughs> under the seat you know? Because there's so there's much so surveillance so here, so right? Around the like car. for example, we are in the car right now. You can see there's a camera on top. This is the one that is responsible for you driving and checking whether you are focusing on the road or not. Um and also the cameras can also take live photos while this we are driving right now. The ca some cameras can uh, record the outside some can record the inside at the same time so we call this this 360 this view uh in in this car so do you think this is a good thing or it's a bad thing i mean it's good for me i feel like it's good because it gives you the opportunity to see you know in case of any maybe an emergency or an accident or there's something happening around you and you want to know what really caused that by the the this future in the car of the camera system you can have an idea of what really who caused the accident and all that mm -hmm. but this future in the car can help you to know what really caused caused that yeah yeah, yeah. because they can just come mm -hmm. to the camera and, uh, and i think it's also a sense of security right because it gives you an idea of what is happening around your surrounding you know your surrounding gives you that idea like mm -hmm. on your left behind you in front of you you have an idea yeah. what okay it gives you an idea and a great deal of uh security yeah. and comfort while you are driving the car right okay? yeah because like you said in china mostly these are disputes that arises when two cars <laughs> are involved in an accident <laughs> yes but nowadays in these modern cars like especially the neo it makes you feel at home because you will know what really happened if it wasn't your fault everything will be recorded like as we are driving this trip is being Miracle. recorded Yes. So you can always go back here. Go back to, to review go back it. To review what happened. Right, right. So which makes it even safer for you, and you don't worry about bad drivers around you because you always you. Even a chance to buy this car, would you buy this car? I'll surely buy this car because one, I live in China, mm -hmm. and I feel like buying something from China whilst I'm here is also a way of creating unemployment and supporting the economy. And mm -hmm. this is made in China, you know. Right. This is made in China. For me, I feel like the Chinese. People are taking over the automobile company system around the world because you go to the dealerships and the kind of cars they have there, it's, it's amazing. Right, right. Well, like when you see this car and you are not told that like, this car was made in China, probably you will not believe it. You right. Know, I think gone are the days when people were like, ah, China, like China, made in China, things. things were bad. You know, like this car was made right here in China. Right, right. I agree with you. And also, a car is an electric car. So what's your take on electric cars? Because I know a lot of people think that um, electric cars are not really strong or they are not good. Uh, but you now experiencing and driving it now and with all these things you have noticed, would you recommend on electric cars or do you believe that the traditional ones, the gas cars, would be an ideal? I think electric cars are being made for a purpose. Mm -hmm. One, to protect the environment. Right. With this carbon emission that is going on around the world, Mm -hmm. We are all trying to contribute our quota to save this world for the future generation, you understand? All right. So I feel like people should move towards this idea of getting these electric cars mm -hmm. so together we can protect our environment and right. make the world a better place. Right, yeah. right. And also, you know, like, I don't think it's a problem having electric cars in China because the system is also built in a way to support this kind of cars. For mm -hmm. example, if you want to charge your car, you just speak to this system right here. Right. And it gives you the exact location of the charging ports or the changing areas where you can go charge, change the batteries of this car. Mm, which brings me to another uh, thing that I want to yeah. tell you. You know, many companies are changing their cars to electric cars. But one special thing about the Neo car, I think so far it is the only one that has a swap station. Mm. And uh, you don't need to charge. Charging is optional. You can just go and swap and it takes you less than... 10 minutes yes you're, so you are from zero to 100 percent with so far neo is offering that other cars i'm not quite sure charging, but neo has this special so it's um it's, it's another this advantage. car everything is automated you can literally pack this car in an automatic way um so what do you feel about that does it promote good driving or it promotes business no it's there's nothing about being lazy when you have something to mm -hmm. Because gone are the days when our parents were grinding on the stone, 
Now we have blenders, Never. right? <laughs> yeah, it makes yeah. life easier and very comfortable, right? Yes. So, like, imagine changing gears all the time. La, 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 la. That's just, you just a press, on, a press a button. Press the button, put on D. And you are going. It go. makes okay. life easier. And that's what we Enjoyable. all... Enjoyable. We all at end for. Like, we all want this world to be easier for us to have a comfortable life. Right. So I don't think, like, having an automatic car makes your life makes you a lazy person. A lazy person. Now, it doesn't make you a lazy person, but in a way, it makes your life very, very comfortable. And enjoyable. And enjoyable. Right.